wanted to share my very favorite nail polish brand. So I have my makeup bag and it's filled with ten polishes that I Unfortunately, it's a very expensive brand, but sometimes I can find a good sale, or I shop at the outlet. So when I'm done, I open the bag. And I'll bring them all out. The reason I like it so much is the formula. Compared to other brands. go on the nails so easily they don't need a base coat or a top coat Describe each polish, and then because I have five and five, 
and I can put them on so you can see what it looks like on the nail so I have one two three
new and I have not worn them. So I'm excited to see what they look like on the nail. And last is Bert the Orient, which is really pretty dark aqua teal color in a cream formula. So, I think I'll go ahead and get a paper towel and do some swatching. Edition. The Rouge Door. And it's the orange one. The gold shimmer. And looks pretty good with just one coat. But we'll still do a second one. Fourth is the Rose Baby Doll. would also look good with just one coat. And our fifth polish for this hand is the bronze Aztec. And this is very shimmer. 
that definitely only needs one coat. So, let's go back and do a second coat on each one that needs it. I don't know if you can tell on the camera, but the formula is the perfect consistency it applies really easily, smoothly. And it dries. Really quick. First hand, all done. How it looks. <laughs> There's the violin surrealist. The coral camis. Rouge Dior. And the gold in this one. It's not super noticeable. But in person, there's more of a sheen and satin finish versus the two creams on either side. And there's the rose baby doll and the bronze aesthetic. So now that we've done this hand, Go ahead and move these and bring in the next set of polishes. So let's start here with the rouge pop art. And this is just a very classic red. And I think it looks good on everybody. And you could get away with one coat, but we'll probably do two, so you can see what it looks like. Now this is one of my favorites. I find I love these light baby blue any blue colors, but usually the formula is 
even but a little bit sheer with just one coat and here's the other new limited edition Carmen Dior Invert Dioid, which is also a favorite because I love these colors. So you can see. My little pinky nail and big brush didn't do a great job, but that's okay. And this one looks like it doesn't need a second coat, but we'll still do one. So, second hand with one coat. Colors. Let's go back and put the second coat on. Here's our classic red. And the blue salad on. So that looks much more open. Sometimes with this, I'll even do three. But that's kind of a pain. So I prefer just two coats. Because they're easier, it takes less time. The Rose Renaissance. Mm. 
two coats. that you can see in the bottle. It's very subdued on the nail. So it's just a pretty dark magenta with a shimmer. And last but not least is the first So here's the right hand lineup. Vert Dior, Carmen Dior, Rose Renaissance, Blue Celadon, and Rouge Pop Art. So the thing about my cell polishes is that the colors aren't really that unique. I don't think anything except maybe bronze Aztec couldn't be found somewhere else. But the formula and the wear on the ease of application make it one of my favorite polishes to use and I've slowly collected way too many of them and I hope you've enjoyed this in case you were ever interested in maybe getting one or two who can see what they look like on the nail and I give them two thumbs way up so thanks for spending the time with me and this video is the first one I filmed since I got braces put on. So I hope that my voice and mouth sounds are okay. And I hope to see you all.